What's up, everybody? This is Ed Hitchens with EnergeticCity.ca, and this is the Community Roundup brought to you by Bratz Furniture and Appliances. Today, we're in the Moose FM studios, and we're talking to Christina Hogarth of the Northern Dance Theatre Society. She's the fundraising coordinator. Christina, nice to see you. How are you doing today? I'm great. Thanks for having me on. Oh, it, it, it's not a problem. Uh, so today, we're going to be talking about turkeys running. I know. No, 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 we're done with, <laughs> done with joking. We're talking about the annual turkey trot, um, and uh, Christina's going to tell us a little bit more about it. Uh, I spoke with you uh, the last time you said that the, the turkey trot is more of a fun run, so tell us a little bit more about what the turkey trot actually is. Yeah, um, this event is a fundraiser for our Northern Dance Theatre Society, and we really like to think of it as a fun community run. You know, we have some amazing runners out here who might do those really hardcore events, but this is also for people who just want to get out um, and have fun. They want some exercise, they want fresh air. Um, you want to walk it, you want to run it, you want to do it with a stroller, with a puppy dog, with a kid on a, on a scooter beside you, whatever works, just get outside, be active, and work up an appetite. Oh, okay, okay, so, so this is an event that really brings out families, yes. community members, friends, together just to get out and, 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 have, and have a good time. Yeah. And, and to free up some, some space for all that turkey that That's right. on Thanksgiving weekend. Yeah, be active before winter sets in. <laughs> okay, all, 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 all right. The theme is Thanksgiving, mm -hmm. and you did mention to me uh, before that there might be a turkey or two running alongside. T tell me about that a little bit. Well, that one is uh, just for fun because we like to make this fun and about kids and family. Uh, we have a little turkey costume that I know I put on last year. Uh, it's just a little onesie. Um, but we do have costume prizes, you know, just fun. If you want to come out and dress in fall attire or you have a hat that's a turkey hat, throw it on. Uh, it just, it, it makes it about participating and such. Um, we also have a bake sale, which is really amazing. Okay. All of our members at our dance society, uh, they bake goods. We have one grandma who bakes dozens and dozens of fresh homemade buns, which okay. is amazing. Those ones go super fast. Um, so even if you aren't gonna run, you can come down to the bake sale. Um, but we've got five kilometers, 10 kilometers, and we have a one kilometer kid stash as well. So lots of different options. Okay, all right, all right. So, so you mentioned prizes, trophies that are gonna yes. be happening. Um, obviously people, when you run, for some people, myself included, I like to be very competitive. Uh -huh. So tell me if uh, what kind of trophies and uh, yeah. prizes are gonna be uh, awarded. I agree, people like to collect things. So for everyone who participates, we've got a lovely little turkey trot medal. And then for the top finishers in the category, we have uh, a very cool uh, turkey trophy. It has a little oh, so turkey. It's going to look like a little turkey. It actually turkey. has a little okay. turkey. Um, my daughter's like, I need to move. I need to participate so I can get one of these. But yeah, those will be for the top finishers in each category, including the children's 1K dash. Um, so yeah, if you win, you got bragging rights. You got a turkey to put on your shelf. Uh, all right. Yeah. The, 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 the new term of the meeting, gobble, gobble. That's right. Anyway, um, I remember the last time you had talked about, you, you, you mentioned that the Northern Dance Theatre Society mm -hmm. participates throughout the year in mm -hmm. what you guys like to call sweat equity. <laughs> so go into, go into that a little bit. What other events do you, do you guys uh, put together throughout the year to raise funds for the, for the uh, society? Well, we actually work a lot for other community groups. That is how we fundraise. So um, we work at one of your events, actually, the Block Party. We have um, some of our members come out and provide labor, helping with tear down and set up. Um, we do movies in the park. We do music in the park. Um, we have a concession that we run at the North Peace Fall Fair, and we've done it at the jet boat races down at Taylor. So we actually flip burgers and french fries. Um, we work at the Petroleum Association Family Weekend, drag races, motocross, like the list is endless. Um, so we are always looking for new ways to so, fundraise. So it's not just giving the, the, uh, the performers uh, an athletic uh, endeavor, but also life skills and helping out the community. Absolutely. This, you know, the, the, the kids know, boys and girls, that, you know, that sport of any type, be it dance, be it hockey, be anything, it's expensive. And they need to help contribute to raise those funds to, to help make their year a success. So... Yeah, it's a group effort. Okay, all right. So um, where can people go find more information about the turkey trot? Yes, please go sign up at zone4.ca. So that's just zone, the number 4.ca. Search turkey trot, um, and then your options will come up to register. So it's $45 for the 5 and 10K events. All kids 12 and under are $15. Whether the kids are running the kids dash or if those younger kids would like, we actually got quite a few who run the 5K, um, they do get the reduced rate as well. 100% of the proceeds 
are going to the Northern Dance Theatre Society. Um, if I can give a quick plug, we've got some sponsors that come on board, which is amazing. Um, Fort St. John Chiropractic Clinic, Fort Motors, Brad's Furniture and Appliances, um, and BCGEU have all come on uh, as sponsors. Browns, uh, Burger King, uh, Gosh, there's so many people that have an ideal OS office solutions. Lots of people contribute to help make this a success, and then that allows us to raise more profits to go towards costumes and fees and all that stuff. Okay, all right. All right. Uh, before I let you go, is there anything else you'd like to add? Um, just please sign up. Uh, the race is on, we should say the date, Saturday, October 12th. Um, so we are just under three weeks away. Uh, weather last year was spectacular. It was hot. It was sunny. So we're hoping for the same. Um, but please go sign up, zone4.ca, and register for the race, and we'd love to see you there. All right. That's all the questions I have. Christina, awesome. once again, thank you very much for the time. This has been Ed Hitchens with EnergeticCity.ca for the Community Roundup. And once again, the Community Roundup is brought to you by Brad's Furniture and Appliances. We'll see you next time.